Hello and welcome. My name is Anna Hoy and this is Anna's Travel Talk. I'm your host and I'm not only a travel enthusiast, but I am the owner and travel specialist with Vacations by Anna Hoy. And today we're gonna to talk a little bit about group travel. If you've ever been on a group trip or thought about traveling, anything like a destination wedding, family reunions, those fun girlfriend getaways, or just a, a weekend away with a group of friends, you're gonna to wanna to stick around because joining me today have Mark Shea and he is the regional manager with Unique Vacations and he represents Sandals and Beaches Resorts and we're gonna share a lot of information with you, his knowledge, experience and information all about groups. So join me in welcoming Mark Shea. Yeah, Hi, Mark. Thank, you. thank you so much for that wonderful presentation. Hello everybody, it's absolutely my pleasure to be with you this morning. Um, I am the regional group sales manager representing Sandals and Beaches in seven Caribbean countries in the islands. Uh, I've been associated actually with Sandals since 1992 when my wife and I first traveled to Sandals Montego Bay. Since wow. then, um, I have actually spent the night at every single Sandals and Beaches resort. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it's really a lot of fun. So group travel is, is absolutely exploding right now. And, and why? Because there's safety in groups. Uh, people love traveling together. Um, you know, there might be somebody listening right now that might be the next group leader, you know, especially if they have a circle of influence uh, or they want to serve as your Pied Piper. So, you know, stay tuned. There's even an opportunity for you to go to a Sandals or Beaches resort for a very nominal fee, almost free, as we like to say in the Caribbean. That's you can select any of our 15 Sandals resorts or three Beaches resorts. Beaches are going to be our family-friendly and single-friendly resorts in seven Caribbean countries. You know, groups come in all sizes, shapes, and types, from tennis groups to golf to pickleball, um, retie the knot, which is our recommitment ceremonies for milestone vacation. Uh, my wife and I actually celebrated our 30th anniversary in Grenada to the exact time. Yeah, thank you so much. That was actually two years ago. So, and I'm a guy that's used to being on the road quite extensively. And obviously COVID has kept me home like so many others. And, um, you know what? <laughs> Your wife's we're, probably uh, not complaining, right, Mark? Well, you know what? It's been, <laughs> it's been a heck of a lot of fun. We're, we've kind of retied the knot here in, uh, in captivity, as I like to say. Uh. You know, so again, you mentioned wedding groups, destination weddings, you know, when in doubt, I call them my friends groups. That's friends of Jack Daniels, friends of Johnny Walker, friends of Jim Beam. You know, again, it's just like-minded people that like to travel together. We even host incentive group travel as well. So keep that in mind. So what is this picture? You know, um, I'm sorry, can you go back real quick? The picture sure on can. top, was that a Mini Cooper group? Uh, well, it was, it was a group. Um, unfortunately, the people that I was traveling with, we didn't know them prior, um, but it was oh, something that my wife and I experienced. We actually went from uh, Sandals, Ocho Rios, to uh, all the way up to Portland to the east. It was about a five hour activity. Um, we stopped at many places along the way that as tourists to Jamaica since 92, I would have never been able to experience ever before. We stopped also for lunch and had a cultural show along the way. Um, we enjoyed the convertible top. And, you know, as we were going through some of these small communities, there were people out there waving and, and uh, saying hello and, you know, wishing they were us. And, you know, the best <laughs> part of this trip you actually drive on the left side of the road. So, you know, as, as they like to say uh, in the Caribbean, left side's the right side, right side suicide. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, it was a, and then... <laughs> yeah, it was, a, it was absolutely a wonderful day. 
It sounds like it. And I remember you telling me the story about when your wife and you, you had a resort that you frequented every few years and you had some special service. Um, and then you were telling me about this, I believe, is this a running group up here on the top left? That was actually, yes, that was the Negril Marathon. Um, and, you know, the great part about that group, again, um, the group leader was able to go for just $400, which is the deposit that's required for one of our rooms. Um, and later in the, in the discussion, I'll talk about how uh, they can achieve that. So this is a little tease right now. Perfect. Yeah. So I'd like to see the different varieties of groups to get people kind of thinking about what, you know, affiliations they might have. Um, I have a friend who is a speaker trainer um, and she does retreats and brings some of her, her clients with her. Um, you know, I have another company that does, I think you mentioned briefly, some incentive trips. So taking the top salesmen and sales people, I should say, <laughs> yeah. on little trips. So, um, and then- No you question. Might, yeah, absolutely. There's so many different types of groups out there. Incentive so, travel is actually one of our fastest growing segments of the business right now. You know, as I like to say, people will run through a brick wall in order to achieve the incentive at a Sandals and Beaches resort. Wow, nice. You know, so yeah, anybody in corporate America, uh, you know, be sure and give Anna a call so that she can work with you on that next route. All right, so we are going to move on to multi-generational travel. You know, this is where grandma and grandpa is wanting to take their kids and their grandkids on a wonderful trip of a lifetime. For me personally, uh, having stayed at the beaches resorts in the past, it's really heartwarming for me to see these families all uh, interacting together, lazy river together, having meals together. That's really a neat environment. Yeah, I think multi from what I'm hearing from some of my clients is multi-generational travel. It's always been big, but it seems like it's, it's, it's pretty big in the last few years. Whereas you mentioned, you know, grandma and grandpa want to take everybody on a trip. So this would be a beaches resort if I'm not mistaken, right? That is because correct, yes. Is for families. Yes. And so there's exactly. a lot of activities at the resorts for all levels, for the kids, for the young adults, for the older folks. From what I understand, there's a little bit of everything for everybody. Absolutely, you know, and there's three beaches resorts. Um, our flagship beaches is at uh, Beaches Turks and Caicos. Um, and then there are two in Jamaica, which are located in Negril and in uh, Ocho Rios. Wonderful. So a group is defined as five or more rooms at a Sandals or Beaches resort. It's really not more complicated than that. Uh, there are inclusions that kick in at the five to nine room level. I call it level one inclusions, and that is a group photo session and a group photograph. And so you can see um, in some of those pictures on the screen, examples of that photo shoot, and then everyone gets uh, a keepsake photograph to take back with them. Uh, level two, the inclusions that kick in there is when the fun really begins because at 10 rooms, you'll receive a free private group dinner, a private cocktail party, group activities, and again, the photo session and the group photograph. So, you know, imagine Anna hanging for a week with your besties and having a game of tug of war on the beach or even playing a round of golf. Yeah, it's a nice fun thing. And I like the fact that there's two different levels. Now, is there different rooms that categories like, or is it just five rooms in and of itself? You know, not just five all rooms ocean views in. or fancy rooms, just any five rooms. Correct. Book together becomes a group. That's level That's one. And yep. then 10 or more is level two which is the Correct. added inclusions. Yes, and that's when you have the private group dinner and you have the private cocktail reception. Nice. Yeah. So speaking of golf groups, who doesn't like free golf green fees? There's several options for golf. 
In Jamaica, it's the Sandals Golf and Country Club in Ocho Rios. Complimentary shuttles run from Beaches Ocho Rios, from Sandals Royal Plantation, and from Sandals Ochi Beach. And these are complimentary, and they run to and from the course every single day. In St. Lucia, there's an 18-hole redesigned Greg Norman course at Kappa State, the only 18-hole golf course on St. Lucia. Complimentary shuttles run from the three resorts. And on resort at Sandals Latak is actually a nine-hole executive course. And then finally, in the Bahamas, there's an 18-hole um, golf course. It is found on Exuma in the Bahamas at Sandals Emerald Bay. It is the famed Greg Norman masterpiece. I mean, they, that's gorgeous. That's literally right on the water. It, it is. It is the Pebble Beach of the Caribbean, as it is often called. You know, and most courses are lucky to have one or two signature holes. Here you can actually find six signature holes on the back nine. They front the ocean. Uh, it's, it's the beautiful turquoise waters of the Caribbean. It's also been photographed many, many times on the Big Break, which is a Golf Channel uh, special. And then every year, the annual PGA Corn Ferry Tour uh, starts the year off at uh, this event as well. So, wow, this is great. And this is a great opportunity for groups because I know several uh, groups of friends who love to golf together. So Emerald Bay um, Sandals, this golf course right here, the Greg Norman, is something that I'm definitely going to tell them about because just looking at the picture and the, the things that you were telling me about the the special, what did you call the different holes? The uh, signature holes. Signature holes. Thank you. I yeah. wanted to get the word right. Um, I think that yeah. they're going to jump on this one. <laughs> there's no question. And, and you know what? If there's somebody listening that is dreaming of a destination wedding, we've even staged uh, destination weddings on the golf course. Uh, it's not unusual for us to have cocktail parties on the golf course as well because look at that picture. I mean, it, it doesn't really do it justice, but at Emerald Bay, Sandals Emerald Bay, there's really something for everybody. Uh, technically, we call it the Sandals Emerald Bay Golf, Tennis, uh, and Spa Resort. That is a mouthful, but that, that says a lot about that resort, though, and, and I like the fact that you use it for a lot of different experiences, so, I, and I have clients that are looking for destination weddings, so I would have never thought of a golf course, but looking at that picture, I could see why. Oh, it's, it's, it's gorgeous. So, speaking of the Pied Piper, um, you know, I always want to know, are there anybody listening that, that might be the next Pied Piper? because if they are, there's a free room in it for them. And let me break that down and tell you how that works. So from September 1st to December 20th, if they help you bring five rooms, that sixth room is reserved for them at just a $400 deposit. Um, and the rest comes from the other rooms that they helped bring. From January 2nd through August 31st, they bring 11 rooms and the 12th one is their room. So that, free, that room can be, you know, free if you help Anna uh, build this group. There are terms and conditions for this, um, so be sure and get with her. Um, but this adds up to some tremendous savings as well. And again, in this picture, you can see examples of tennis group, our marathon groups, just some ladies hanging together. I love that sandals um, <laughs> photograph. And yeah, that's pretty can, fantastic deal. You know, bring some rooms, get your room for free. For I mean, sure. you, the, you know, you guys are, you got four star service with all of the restaurants and entertainment and beach activities. So having that room for free is a huge incentive. For so sure. If, you and want, if you're a group leader of any kind of club or organization, or you're the person putting together that 
golf trip or that destination wedding or even the family reunion, the fact that you could earn your room for free is huge. Thank you exactly. for sharing that with the audience. It's easier for me to tell you what isn't included, gift shop, spa, and excursion. Everything else from the moment you touch down at any of those seven islands and you're uh, escorted to the resort complimentary to and from, from the airport, you know, all those little incidentals sure add up. But with us, you know what your exposure is even be before you leave the house. Yeah, I really like that because um, you could go a little overboard when you're on vacation, right? So the fact that you know that your food and your drink and your entertainment on the premises, and if I'm not mistaken, are you able to visit if you're staying at one Sandals Resort and there's another Sandals Resort in the same area, are you able to visit? Under normal times, absolutely. Now, you know, with the uh, onset of COVID, um, we're limiting that to the resort that you're actually staying at. Understood. But hopefully when, um, you know, this is all in the rear view mirror, you know, that certainly is going to come back in play because that's been a hallmark of our organization for so many years. Yes. Thank you for sharing that. So when you're getting ready to book with Anna, there's actually two ways to do it. I'm, and I'm just going to boil it down really, really quickly. Um, just give her a call. She'll get you the absolute best rate. Um, that's what we call a group code reservation. You can lock that rate in with just $400. Um, your final payment is due 45 days prior to travel. And if life happens and you're not able to make the trip, um, you will receive a full refund within 31 days prior to travel. The other option is with a contract. The beauty of the contract, it locks in the rate at the time of the booking. Um, the payment terms are a little different. So again, reach out to Anna who can articulate all the differences for you. Uh, we're even currently offering a contract discount offer with an additional savings of anywhere between eight and 10%. And she'll have all those details for you. What I like personally about a contract, if it's a destination wedding and the bride and groom won't be getting married for another two years, for instance, um, the rates are going to be locked in at today's dollars. And I can tell you a couple of things are liable to happen two years from now. One is we won't have the availability or two, chances are the price is going up because we are in a supply and demand business. And, you know, when you take out a couple of our larger resorts, we're really a collection of boutique hotels because even, you know, the sweet spot for rooms is anywhere in the 200, 250 range. And compared to big box hotels, that is a very small boutique resort, as I like to call it. Yeah, and you were mentioning, you know, the availability and what I'm trying to let my clients know and what I'm finding um, is that a lot of folks who had their vacations postponed or canceled are rebooking. And I believe the percentage is really, really high for resorts that they're rebooking at the same resort. So what that means is that if you're looking to travel to uh, any of the Sandals or Beaches resorts, maybe next summer, you actually should start planning now so that you can have the availability on the dates or the location of the, the suites or the rooms that you're looking for, um, because it is selling out due to, you mentioned, you know, supply and demand. So are you finding that to be true as well? Yeah, there's no question that the, the more in advance you book a reservation, the more likelihood you're going to be able to get the rate and the type of accommodation you're looking for. You know, and let's face it, um, this has been a very, very unusual year, as we all know. And I really believe that it's putting a strain on availability for 21, because a lot of people have already um, decided to suspend their trip this year and rebook for 21. So if you're interested in a 21 vacation, really the sooner the better always prevails. 
Yes, thank you for that. Yeah, wow. I'm finding that to be true. And then you touched on a little bit about, since we're in this current time with COVID, um, you know, I know that all of the resorts have, have taken some extreme safety and cleanliness protocols. And is that listed on your sandals uh, website? They should contact me if they want to know what's open right Absolutely. now. Absolutely. Yep. Our, uh, our uh, platinum protocols um, are in place. We're very um, diligent about these things. You have to be blessed by the local governments in these safety practices. So it's something that we feel very strongly about. And, um, you know, as is the case with many of the things that we do, we were the leaders in, in this uh, orientation. Yes, and I did read that um, about sandals and beaches. And I appreciate that as a travel advisor and also as a traveler that I can feel comfortable you know, coming to one of your resorts to know that you have these protocols in place to keep your staff safe, but also the visitors safe. So thank you sure. for sharing that information. Oh my well. gosh, you're welcome. You know, and, and I'm having a number of Zoom calls with travel advisors around the country who are visiting our resorts, experiencing what's going on. And I'll tell you what, they have given us nothing but high praise on uh, how we're governing ourselves. That's great. I love to hear that. <laughs> yeah. Well, folks, we would love to absolutely play host to your next group. Um, you have our commitment and my commitment as the uh, regional manager of groups that I'm going to assist Anna any way I can so that she can engage in a flawless execution on your ne next group's trip. So, with that, I'm going to say thank you very much um, for everyone's time and attention today. And Anna, if you have any more questions, um, you know, I'd be delighted to help. And again, folks, you can see her uh, telephone number is, uh, is listed on the screen. So she's available to make your dreams come true. Oh, uh, thank you. With your help, Mark, and your team at the Sandals and Beaches Resorts. And thank you for sharing all your knowledge and experience with the audience today. And if we've inspired you today, please hit that subscribe button and we go live every Tuesday. So you'll be notified when we upload new content. And today we shared all about groups. And if you want to be a group leader or you are a group leader, please reach out to us. We'd love to talk to you a little bit more in detail on how you can earn a free room and plan that dream vacations for your group at any of the seven sandals and three beaches resorts so thank you for watching this has been anna's travel talk and we'll see you next time